guys, CJ here, and today we're going to be looking at some building techniques. So I have with me the apartment mock, and so let's just go with some building techniques. And um, this is really simple because there is going to be some new people uploading on Jawa Bricks Channel 2. If you haven't already seen that channel, um, go check it out after this video. Um, but you can might be able to, you might want to go check it out now because all the stuff you'll see in the following video is going to be quite simple building techniques. Um, but this is just for beginners, so let's get straight into it. So first off, we're going to do how to make your grass look good. And um, um, so what we're doing here is get lots of green plates, angled stuff, and then kind of make it look natural. So don't layer them all like um we just put them randomly so it doesn't look man-made just like place them randomly don't put them in a specific order and then you can get tons of these little pieces here the stalks to which um flowers are going to go on don't put the flowers on just put them there and then these corner one by one pieces with the three leaves on and you get a really really nice effect Now next up, how to do kind of mountain building. So you want lots of angled pieces like this. And again, don't put them like specific order. Just put them random. Make sure it all fits together get, though. Here's another example, just randomly all around. Uh, try get some different shades in. So you see I've got dark gray and light gray and dark brown and light brown there. Uh, so it, um, it looks better. And then round here, um sliding stuff so what you really want to do you want to build a like a kind of trough around it uh, and then get it to the right size and then put tiles at the bottom and it should just slot in and slide perfectly um then how to make trees like this just want tons and tons of round one by one bricks and uh just kind of put them on uh, a kind of a slant don't put them on fully um so that kind of it's cool then really basic stuff now um how to make that you can make them hold a flat tile item so i'll get another cookie here and i'll get a mando and so you can just get the arm like that uh, and then you want to kind of put their hand in that way so one of their finger things is clipped in and then just bend it to the side and it should clip in like that and you can have a mando cookie shouldn't it be a wookie cookie that rhymes at least so that's cool uh, and then of course um, you can you can pose their legs and stuff so don't just put them just like like that because really that gives no character whatsoever kind of pose him and stuff so like make him look i know many figures fail to look real but make him them look real uh like kind of posing them and stuff bring their arms up a little like you would if you were walking and then kind of put them on a diagonal slant so because you never uh, so it's kind of more believable I guess you could say. Then again, here repeated, uh, kind of the same as a couple ones. Just if you have uh, a block like that, then you just get their arm and their hand should, well, will fit inside just like that. You can hold it. Um. Then in here, you don't always. This isn't. Sorry, my hands in the way. You don't always have to do this. Um, but count sometimes and move skateboards out the way it can kind of look cool if you put stuff in diagonally especially stuff like crates but if you want you can put, put them in like that and then uh, with like stuff like the skateboards and the snowboard sorry my hand's so annoying you can kind of lean them up against like that like you would after you come back from uh, skating or something 
um, when you've just been skating out, then kind of make them look believable again. Then you can um, get get chairs like diagonal by doing. Uh, hang on, can't see that. Got them right. Yeah. So you can see by putting that piece there. Oh, bam. And you can kind of put the chair in diagonally, and the dog fell over. And then um, to make stuff like TVs and computers and stuff, use one of those diagonal. Use one of these pieces, one of the 90 degree inverted uh, angle pieces, um, so it can look good. And you can still clip it down. Cool. Then. Um, yeah, so you can use bricks diagonally too. Um, yeah, and this just what I just wanted this to be really quick. Oh, um, a little. Sh oh yeah, last one actually. Water, clear stud. So like these types of studs. So um, like here. Yeah, so clear ones clear dark blue ones and clear light blue ones they all do really well if you have lots of them you can make like a little pond or a lake or something which looks better than just putting blue plates down it looks a ton better because it kind of looks more like lego water wood um so yeah this was just going to be a little showcase so Beginners in Lego who, well, who I hope I have inspired. That is one of my aims, to inspire people to get building. Get out there, get building. Do it. Um, and I hope you, uh, some beginners, I hope you found this useful. Um, tell me if you did and comment what else you'd like to see. In the next video. So this is CJ's. Ah, see you soon, guys.